selection of the Caribbean Stars TNT Boys Under 15 Community Football Tournament. Yeah? Give a round of applause for that now. Nice. Now, before we start any proceedings, there are certain protocols. There are certain protocols that we must observe. So all of you who are seated, could you please stand for the national anthem of Trinidad and Tobago. Thank you very much, my DJ. Thank you very much. Now, in everything we do, we always need to acknowledge the undisputed power and presence of Almighty God. So to make intercession for us today is a gentleman by the name of Mr. Victor McGill. He's the brother of the founder, CEO, and president, Mr. Alwyn Gill. Yeah, let's hear it for Mr. Victor McGill. Thank you, Ben. Thank you. Let's take the time now. Bow your heads. Close your eyes if you wish. And we are going to God. Our gracious and loving Heavenly Father, we are grateful for life itself. And Lord, as we have come together this evening, Lord, to have fun and fellowship in sport, we pray, O oh God, that your presence will be here with us, that you will protect every individual from any danger, accident, or any injury. We pray, O oh God, that it will be a time of competitive fellowship. And we pray, O oh God, that at the end of it all, we will continue to give you the praise, the honor, and the glory. For nothing is worth anything without the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you again, Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. McGill. Nice. So we're ready to start. The team's looking nice, so they're looking good. They're ready for a day of great football. So to officially open the games now, I would be bringing to the microphone a gentleman who I've met many years ago. Yeah? He's been involved in sport administration since 1989 and was duly awarded a National Hummingbird Medal Bronze in the Fair of Sport for his dedicated service in 2022. This gentleman worked with FIFA World Cup as a freelance officer, mainly in safety and security, from the under-17 level straight up to the men's level. His most re recent assignment was at the just-concluded 2023 FIFA Women's World Cup in New Zealand. Let's hear it for Mr. Norris Ferguson. Thank you very much. Good afternoon to all the young participants. I'm not going to keep you in the sun very long. I know what it's like to be there. I just want to take the opportunity to officially open the Caribbean Stars Under-15 tournament this afternoon. <laughs> 
Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Mr. Ferguson. So with that said and done, we're here at Hague Street Carnage Recreation Grounds for the 2023 Caribbean Stars TT Boys Under 15 Community Football Tournament. Make some noise. Caribbean Stars Boys Under 15 Football Tournament 2023. Congratulations to both teams one of these evenings and check it out. Seeing the teams greeting each other. Thank you. 
Come on now. Light up, Bishay. Come on. Oh, in possession. Still hot for the shot. What a goal! A bullet of a shot. Market. Market. We don't have to run the shot from the shot. Come on, and the goalkeeper comes What a goal! Goal, goalkeeper coming! Okay! Let's see what's going on! Jada BBA! Same score now, Jada Riley, aka Jim Jun. Yes! Oxana, another goal! Another goal! Three nil now! Jackson and Santa Hawks! Wow! Caribbean Stars Committee and uh, on behalf of the uh, tournament, co ongoing tournament, the under 15 football tournament, and for your contribution and investment into sports, namely to the young people of Trinidad and Tobago. This is a token of appreciation bestowed upon you. Your full name, Cedric Hazelwood, and we want to inspire you and encourage you to continue, especially at this time to impart and invest in the area of sporting development for the young people of Trinidad and Tobago. Today, on behalf of the District of Chagamas Point Commander, I, Councillor Kevin Williams, congratulate you and salute you, congratulate you and salute you, and encourage you to continue being a patriot in the area of sport for Trinidad and Tobago. And let's hear a nice little round of applause for Mr. Yeah. Mr. Yeah. Jake Yes, yeah. sir. You yeah. see the yeah. 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 people tell me he was a really, really good footballer. Yeah. Yeah. Make some noise for your very own Mr. Junior Pep. Yeah. 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 You see the yeah. award yeah. on the council for Shadamas yeah. Point Commander. Yeah. Well, this person is no stranger to me. Mr. Junior Phillips, on behalf of Caribbean Stars, 
and the 15 tournament and the organizing committee. And on behalf of the borough of Digo Martin, on behalf of the Carnage Community Council, I am quite proud to stand here and present this token of appreciation for your contribution to sporting development, not only as a coach, but as a player, as an advocate, as a responsible citizen of Trinidad and Tobago, who will serve your country well, as a national footballer, as a police officer, and as a sport enthusiast. Continue being a pioneer, continue being an ambassador, continue with your sporting intervention for the young people of the community. I know the parents, I know the community are quite proud and they are pleased with your contribution. And most importantly, continue being your own source of inspiration and being that well-rounded citizen that the communities of Trinidad and Tobago very much need at this time. I salute you. I salute you, Mr. Junior Phillips. Let's make some noise for everyone, Mr. Junior Phillips. Collecting his award of recognition. So we're getting set now for another presentation of the recognition award. This award goes to this gentleman. He's one, as I was told, one of the founding members of the Trendsetter Corps, along with Mr. Wickham, we know him as Dada. This gentleman is recognized for his vision, passion, commitment, and contribution to the Trendsetter Hawks and football in general. He has helped the club to become an academy and a beacon of hope for the youth football in Trinidad and Tobago. The gentleman I'm speaking about is none other than Mr. Clyde Johnson. Make some noise. Mr. Johnson, Mr. Clyde Johnson, who, as the MC rightfully said, one of the founders of Trendsetter Hawks, Trendsetter Hawks. On behalf of Caribbean Stars and the Under-15 Tournament, on behalf of the Borough of the Martin, on behalf of the Carnac Community Council, I want to say congratulations and I salute you. I want to challenge you to inspire more citizens like yourself to get involved in youth development, to get involved in sport development. This is a social, recreational and economic intervention to what is needed in the country right now towards our nation's young people. So, thank you for your personal sacrifice. Thank you for the sacrifice of your family and thank you for being a patriot of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago. Yes, so make some noise for Mr. Clyde Johnson, electing 